We're gonna tell you the best way to invest in your YouTube channel, and we're starting right now. What is going on? My name is Nick. Welcome to another video. If this is your first time here and you want to learn how to grow your channel, make videos, and all types of other YouTube related stuff, start now by subscribing and clicking the bell so you don't miss anything. Okay, I'm here with Daryl Eves, YouTube expert, and what we're going to talk to you about today is things that you need to invest in when it comes to your YouTube channel because as your YouTube yeah. channel grows you know it's important that you you know you invest back into what it is that you're doing if you really want things to work out right absolutely I mean this is a business at the end of the day and if you don't invest in yourself and in your business it's harder to succeed yeah. that's the way I look at it sure sure and and that comes down to a bunch of things you know it comes down to you know camera equipment you know it's important to have you know good right. camera equipment as you grow so you can make sure that you're making things look great and sound great for your audience good microphones right good thumbnails yeah good, good thumbnails, thumbnails. And, and things like that as well you know like even if you don't have the skill set yourself even investing in right. a designer paying even if it's on right. Fiverr paying five bucks for something that would like be if you're better. not gonna go learn the skill like pay for someone that has that skill to actually do it right so. right so for my branding though I actually asked you to do it and you actually did a great job. Right, thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> so there's another thing that is extremely important um, when it comes to investing in your YouTube channel. And in my opinion, it's the most valuable. Right. And that is coming to events like like we're at right now, which you know, right now we're at VidCon. And um, Daryl actually has an event as well called Vid Summit. And let me tell you something, um, last year when I went to Vid Summit, um, I had uh, just over 70,000 subscribers, okay? As we have this conversation, right, I've got over 200,000 subscribers. Coincidence? I don't think so. <laughs> so, Daryl, tell us a little bit about the. Uh, tell us a little bit about your conference. Well, look, I, I go and speak and train all over the world. I'm at, at you know on different conferences, and there's things that I like about certain conferences and things that I don't like about the conference. And so, when I uh, started the Vid Summit five years ago, I wanted to be able to learn from people that I wanted to learn from. So that first Vid Summit, I just invited people that I wanted to learn their skill set and so on and so forth. Because learning is so important. I mean, you're, you're watching this video, you're learning right now, and right. it is all about learning to really grow and come up to your full uh, true potential. And so I put this together because I thought that there was a, a need because no one was actually talking about the business side of the industry. They weren't talking about the true opportunity. They're, you know, most of them are fans and connecting with creators or, you know, they're just trying to schmooze. Well, Vid Summit is all the business side of things. And that's what I actually started uh, five years ago and it's gone really well. Yeah. And, and you know, what's funny is um, we're here at VidCon and, and VidCon's awesome, but Everybody that I've been talking to, you know, they're like, yeah, you know, it's cool. Everybody that's been to Vid Summit that yeah, I've yeah. talked to, and they're they're here. Everybody's like, you know what? I like Vid Summit better because it's more, you know, more product productivity stuff going on, more learning going on, more valuable information that's being shared at Vid Summit. I was telling my brother D, I was telling him, I was like, oh, you you think this is good? I was like, wait until you go to Vid Summit. <laughs> I was like, you know, Vid Summit's gonna blow your socks off if you uh, if you enjoy this. Well, here's the thing: every event has its purpose, and I love VidCon. Oh, yeah, I mean, yeah. VidCon is just so amazing, and I've been here nine years. It's just been phenomenal however it is big yeah. and at vid summit we cap it at, at 1300 people we do have virtual tickets to expand it that way but i, I want to keep the culture and the culture of the vid summit is that we're willing to share uh, we're willing to give uh, tips and techniques a lot of people don't know this but i i literally have started 21 channels and got them over a million subscribers each and uh, 33 billion video views. They only just see me, oh, you're this YouTube guy that right. you know is on giving tips. Well, the only reason why I did that was I got really sick of answering the same questions to my clients, and I started a channel to, to, to show that and also build a little audience. The reality is, is there's people that you don't even know that they are like the man or the woman in their industry and they really know their stuff. Those are the types of people that I get to present on stage. And so I'm like, who is these people? These are unknowns, but yet these are the ones that are actually pulling the strings and making the levers go. The people go. behind the scenes. And they're, they're the ones that are actually the smart people that yeah. are actually growing the audience. Yeah, yeah, so here's what I recommend. Um, like I said, you know, in a six months time, because that was back in October. So in six months time, um, you know, I went from 70,000 or a little over 70,000 to like 200 and some change right now. I think I'm like 217. And like I said, you know, a lot of that is from applying a lot of the stuff that I learned at Vid Summit and, you know, stuff that I've learned from you just in general anyway. Right. So it is it's a critical thing. Like if you really want to, you know, get what it is that you're after here, because, you know, your YouTube channel can be a business. It can be it can create opportunities for you that you can't even imagine right now. So it's important that you as your channel 
channel grows and as you can invest back into your channel, it's really important that you do come to events like this. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a link down in the description of this video um, that I want you to click on and just go look at the page, go see the information, go see who's gonna be there at the event. I'm actually gonna be at the event. Um, you're obviously gonna be there. Yep. Um, you know, like if, if you want to rub shoulders with people that are doing it, then you need to come to come to Vid Summit. Daryl, anything else? Yeah, I think the big thing about it, I know a lot of you are like, hey, I don't, this is way expensive, I can't afford it. Sure, sure. We do have a virtual ticket option and you could be in your pajamas somewhere halfway around the world and, and really engage with it. And we also have replays after that. It's basically, it's the live stream, same cost. It'll be for the replays that's there. The main reason why we actually do it at the price there is we want people that are actually serious about it and we want it exclusive. We want it to be it small enough that you can actually approach the speakers and trainers and not have them just run off because they're getting mobbed. Sure, sure, and you know that's that's also one of the things that that I noticed um, here as well. And again, not knocking VidSummit because it's awesome, but um, or not knocking VidCon because it's awesome. Um, but that is one of the things I noticed here is you know when a speaker's finished, there's just so many people that you it, like you have to wait in these big lines to talk to people right. and things like that. Whereas um, VidSummit, it's a much more intimate experience and and really like just the information that you hear standing in circles. Well, here's here's the thing that most people don't know. Uh, in the audience at Vid Summit last year, these are not the people that are presenting, and I don't even know if you know these, these stats, but we had five people that had over 10 million subscribers, mm -hmm. and I know subscribers is you know all relative, but we had 136 that had over a million, nice. and we had 526 total that had over 100,000. Nice. Nice. So, so I mean, that, that tells you, even at that even at that level, yeah. right? Even at that level, like they understand how important it is to make sure that you're going, that you're rubbing elbows in these situations, that you're educating yourself, that you're learning as much as you can, because here's the thing. Like, as you know, Daryl, it's like, like things that you're learning today might not necessarily apply, you know, a year from now, right? right? Things that you're learning today might not necessarily apply six months from now, but what's shared at VidSummit, that keeps you current in exactly what is happening right now. So it's really important that you keep that in mind and that you that you invest in yourself and in your channel if you really want to if you really want to make your YouTube channel happen really important well thank you yeah so Daryl thank you so much for uh, coming on I really appreciate it yeah, man. and um, and I will see you and hopefully you at vid summit let's do it and again I'm gonna have a link to vid summit down in the description so make sure that you go and click on that right now go see what it's all about and if you want to learn how to grow your channel make videos and all types of other YouTube related stuff start now by clicking the round subscribe icon so you don't miss anything thank you so much for watching I'll see you next time